He has risen to the pinnacle of his career in the Nigerian army and it is time for Lieutenant General Kenneth Minima to be pulled out. For him, it was a thing of pride to have joined the army, served in the army and retired meritoriously in sound health. Minima, in his last words before being pulled out of the army, stresses that serving in the military is a service to humanity because it's only the profession that you pay the supreme price. Minima urges serving officers to sustain the current momentum and strive at all times to bring an end to the difficult moment of the country's present security challenges. Instead and rekindled fighting spirit in the troops backed by military sanctions. I'm happy to state that the story is different today and the situation much better than I met it. Today, the country is more secure and stable. The ability of Boko Haram terrorists to confront our security forces in, the, in open combat is virtually non-existent. Its leadership is in hiding, afraid of their lives, and no longer intimidating the public with propaganda videos. Sensing immediate defeat, they have resorted to targeting innocent and vulnerable civilians in churches, mosques, markets, bus stations, and all places of gathering. The former army chief calls on all soldiers to remain loyal and demonstrate total commitment to their nation, irrespective of the circumstances while also charging Nigerians to join ends with the security operatives to ensure that insecurity becomes a thing of the past. A nation is as strong as its armed forces. And the strength of the armed forces is in the quality of the individual soldier and his fighting spirit. Fighting spirit imbues him with confidence to stand up to the adversary rather than flee like we witnessed in the recent past. Lieutenant General Kenneth Minima served at different levels in the Nigerian Army. He served as a General Officer Commanding 81 Division, Commanding Officer of the 149 Infantry Battalion 2, and Commandant Officer of the Nigerian Army School, amongst others.